your love for Jesus who died and is now gone above. We praise you, O oh God, for your spirit of light who has shown us our Savior and scattered our night. Hallelujah, thine the glory. Hallelujah, amen. Hallelujah, thine the glory. Revive us again. Hallelujah, thine the glory. All right, hey, Kyle, talking to Kyle. <laughs> what are you doing down here, first of all? I'm headed to work. Where do you work at? Uh, TJ Fridays at East Plano. Get out of here. So what are you doing here? <clears throat> About to get on the train. All right, as we're, as we're walking to the train... You going to work or you going to school? I'm going to work. Going to work. What do you do? I'm a day surgery nurse at Parkland. If I say the word church, when you think of church, what do you think of? I know generalizations. Institution. Yes. Good or bad in your mind? Indifferent. What Indifferent. comes to your mind when I say revival? Religion. Religion. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Good. Has it ever affected you in any way, good or bad? Yes. Give me an example, can you? Uh, I went to a Christian school, so I went to church all the time. We're talking about uh, revival, when that word, when you hear that, what do you think of when you think of revival? Uh, revival, like come back to life, uh, you know, energize, be revived, you know. I don't even know what that word means. Revival. Southern Southern Baptist. Southern Baptist. So, yeah. Tent revivals, church revivals. Your mind. Dying and coming back to life. When you think of the word revival, what do you think of? What? A creek. Thank you. How do you personally get refreshed or renewed on a weekly basis? What would you say? Taking a shower. <laughs> Taking a shower. You in particular. How do you get revived on a regular basis? Red Bull. Tu necesitas. Be refrescar. Do you? Tú necesitas refrescarte. Sí. In Dio. Sí. Do you think it's a fair statement that the church, us, needs to be revived? America needs a revamp. <laughs> but the sad part is, and this is my encouragement, is, is that we've got to stop looking at God based on, I know this is going to sound weird, at Christians. Christians don't necessarily live out how they're supposed to live. But God proves his own love for us that while we are still sinners, Christ died for us. What comes to your mind when you think of revival? Lord. Lord, why? Because everybody's soul needs to be renewed and revived on a daily basis. You need to be revived, big statement, in the Lord. No. Does God play any role in your life when you think about going through life, honestly? Not as much as he used to. And literally, Jesus' hand is down here saying, Heather, I'm, I'm ready to help you now. And what you are saying is, I'm sitting on my hand saying, not yet. I know. And I'm here to say, he wants to help you. So maybe if we started encouraging people to look to Jesus, we might actually start seeing a revival. Doesn't that sound refreshing? Like, makes me want to hug you. <laughs> Because in Matthew 5, Jesus says the blessed are the poor in spirit, which means those that are humble, those that are longing to have a sovereign God help them, He will. Is it fair that you need to be revived back into your relationship with God? Yes. This, it says in Hebrews, is alive and active, and it's piercing. I have absolutely no idea what I'm looking for. And it sucks on the side.